Okay, so I was trying to find like an appropriate place to put this, but basically, uh, remember how I've been talking about this girl like Tiara? I guess like Tiara's pretty great. She's pretty, but like, I guess like Nashville, and Nashville is a super white ass, like Tennessee is a super white ass state. This is like, uh, the it's pretty, it's kind of country. It's the home of country music for sure. They literally call it Music City, but she's on the cover of, uh, I guess it's like Nashville Lifestyle as like the most beautiful person in nashville so um I, that should just be highlighted i was i was gonna try to figure out how to make another video about that and maybe i'll just like read her interview in the actual magazine but it's just notable to highlight that okay i also put just another picture of jordan dunn because she's like number in terms of the ai algorithm that voted the most beautiful people i think she was like number six or seven which, you know, whatever. She was on the list that, whatever. And Carrie Washington is currently on the uh, cover of, like, Bazaar UK. This is, like, Bazaar Britain, which is, like, a European magazine. And, like, she's on the cover right now. That All those things are saying a lot about culture and beauty. And this is another reason. So some people keep commenting on that video that I made about, like, Ice Spice. And the reason that I keep making these videos is because, like, some of y'all, like, I know you guys think that, some, or some of you, not all of you, but especially, like, some black women. Like, in the the black community, first of all, in America is very small. The nigger community is even smaller, but they are just so loud with their, like, all of the things that they believe are counterculture. When I'm saying counterculture, I literally mean, like, it's opposite of mainstream culture, which means that there is a such thing as mainstream culture. So, like, given that, like, black people are 13% of the population, that means that, what is it, like, fucking 87% of the population basically has beliefs and cultures, storm, standards, norms that are different than what this one, and in, the weird part about that is even of the 13% of black people in this country, like, black Americans, the people who are the loudest are like 0.001%. Like here, are just, 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 these are just three black women, but they're like literally so phenomenally, extraordinarily talented and beautiful that they've made it to like the cover and the, like they are the people who are being recognized for their beauty. These are black women. They're just, they're, they're black women who are like, being being uh recognized as being more beautiful than other people and so i make my my channel i talk a lot about aesthetics i talk about kind of like i wouldn't say like traditional culture actually i, I feel like i just point out obvious shit that's like it's like unpopular opinions in traditional culture like i i honestly i feel like i hate counterculture and i've always been like that but i tried to tolerate it for a while because i was being kind but i'm just no longer interested in being kind so yeah like honestly at this point i just don't really give a shit i'm just trying to make a point here like when I make those videos about, like, Nicki Minaj being kind of dusty and, like, Ice Spice being ugly, you can believe, like, there are, there are, you know what, like, probably, like, I don't know, 5% of the black American community who are like, oh, my God, she's everything and they love her and that's why they're watching her videos. But at no point is she, like, take, like, how can I describe it? Like, she just doesn't, she, she might represent, like, 5% of this population believes that. That's a very small percent. So even if you are watching this and you're like, yeah, but all black men believe this, that's fine. That's 13% of this population believes that. That's a small ass percent. It's just not that many people. And I'm just saying, like, I don't even care if all of, if every black person I run across in life believes this, I still don't care because I personally don't believe that. Like, I have my own opinion and I'm just voicing to you on my channel my opinion. And some people are calling me a hater. I'm not being a hater. I'm just saying, like, the beauty industry is a thing. And just because, like, I personally don't, like, agree with you, it's, like, that's all it means. Like, I personally don't agree with you. That's it. Like, we don't have to agree. Like, we just don't have to. We don't have to.